after finishing up the season's longest road trip, six games over 11 nights, the Heat is back in Miami and now play eight of their next 10 games at home. Tonight, a four-game homestand begins against one of the NBA's best teams and top stories this season. First of two meetings between the Heat and the high-scoring Houston Rockets. We always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. Well, the Heat back at home and Miami Heat basketball back on Fox Sports Sun and presented by AT&T. Good evening, Heat Nation. Welcome inside the American Airlines Arena. The Heat's first game here since the first night of January, and the Knights face an ultimate challenge against the 32 and 11 Houston Rockets. It is time for your starting lineup. Begin with the home Heat, Rockets, Waiters, Whiteside, Babbitt, and Magruder ready to roll against the Rockets. Little shift in the lineup here with Harden, Beverly, Capella back in the mix, Ariza, and Brewer first quarter action Ariza from Harden and it's in the corner this is what he's been doing all year trust yes. the shooters that are out there and he knows where they are at all times without looking they get to those spaces waiters not waiting that is a splash down on the Tyler kick out Ariza back on the screen and here's the thing that keeps Houston balance most night while they're outside they will come inside and put it on that's right points in the paint and three pointers nothing in between double hota looking for the Slashing Dragon. 32-27 Houston after one. Let's go to the second quarter. More Dragon for your analysis, John. That's just going to the bread and butter. No rotation across. Dragon finishes at the rim. All right, now check out Whiteside, Whiteside down there for the cone of glory. All right, he sees it. <laughs> that is getting on the runway, baby, for the offensive rebound in the foot. <laughs> that is sizing it up. I love it. And then Waiters in transition. A little and one basketball. He screams and one after every shot. He really does. Part of an 11-2 run. It makes Will Manso giggle. <laughs> Beverly. <laughs> little fast break action off the Ariza steal. We were knotted at 53 at the break. I like to call that a tussle. Third quarter. More double J. One thing he can do in transition off the turnover is finger roll. Ooh. I thought he might be spinning. That wasn't sure. Oh, man. That would be a long setup for that one. Mercy. Let's see it again. Can I get the little... Oh, put down there. Just went down in the bread basket and got it, didn't he? Really nice shovel pass to his right there by Waiter. Now, the beard will do this to you, man. He doesn't need a whole lot of room, conscience, or indignation. I agree. Don't make him a jump shooter. I was successful tonight. Let's see, what was he? 4 of 15 beyond the arc. That's one of five from the land of milk and honey for Mr. Ellington. That made it a one-point game. Miami with the lead. And this is just rough right there. That's all-star MVP Six team leader five, mentality. 220 taking contact and able to finish going to the offhand. Gives you a little, little bicep flex for you. They freaks you out in person okay, when you check out the 6-5. The, the it doesn't feel that way on the floor. Yeah. Moving on, that was just some insight and analysis That's by you. The beard. beard. The beard gives him a bigger circumference. circumference there. I need to stay in my lane. Did you just go circumference I on I did, it? I did. That is solid lay down right there. Here's the Cleveland Clinic team play of the game. Rockets, Tyler. Oh, oh. Tying up two defenders, leaving it open for Tyler. One more time. Okay. Elevation without hesitation. Right now. Smooth, smooth. Russia. Is that the old karate wraparound right there? I love it. Look at the, just the presence of mind to know he had two on him. Look at that. And Tyler's finishing. That wasn't a replay. Point. That was a three play. That was ridiculous. Here we go. 14-3 run. All Miami. That's a blow by. What do you got? Nothing. That was my line back in the day. Who you got? Nobody. 102-94. Here it is, baby. Ellington in the corner. Bus driver. I need a bus driver for the Rockets. They want to go team hotel, airport. They can go wherever they want. Back to Mickey Beach. I don't know. It's up to them now. Hard, nice work, but need a little bit more from the masses. How about Goran Dragic right there? Almost the triple-double right there, as you were selling it yeah, early. Yeah. Triple threat Miami style. Team was excellent, but three guys in double figures. Look at this off the turnover. Tyler Johnson finishing his slashing style uh, to the basket. Look at him continuing to stay on top stay of with the it. perseverance. Wayne Ellington with five three made three balls made five of nine 18 points to lead everybody and again Tyler finishing and then I, 
you know, I really liked his aggressiveness looking for his shot. And this guy right here for me was outstanding. Not only scoring the ball, James Johnson, uh, with 15 points, but how about six assists and then eight boards? I mean, tremendous job providing a matchup uh, problem for the Rockets all the time. Wayne Ellington shooting the basketball well again on, on this guy right here. I, I just can't say enough. He's got himself in such great shape. These three guys, this three-headed monster right here was outstanding in terms of overall production for Miami. It's almost like he's running downhill all night long. Now, everything didn't go the way he wanted to every single time at the rim, but just creating that stress on the defensive screen. Well, he's had, look, it's, it's taken him a while to get back into this kind of groove coming back from the 20 games out. I love the way he attacked the basket. He was finishing more effectively. Look at him here with the left hand. He went left, he went right. This one here, he, he's known for being a scorer and they want to overplay his shooting hand. He did a good job of picking his spots, when to attack off the dribble, when to look for the jumper. And again, he can continue uh, to get to the free throw line. I think that's a good thing for Miami. Job leading the team, not only making points and baskets, but finding a way to get the, his teammates involved to rebound the basketball. Look at him here running this one down and pushing tempo. So surprising to me was how quick the Heat were able to get out on the break and, and beat a team who does this night in and night out uh, in the fast break game. 23 to 19, the Heat outscored the Rockets. Doesn't sound like much, but I, I thought that was really important to this game. Uh, the Dragon had 21 points. He had eight boards. He had eight assists. Uh, you know, did a great job, I thought, uh, doing a lot of things and, and most importantly, incorporating his teammates as you see him hand off uh, a really nice pass to Tyler, getting his three-point shooters involved. Uh, just a great overall performance by the Dragon. At times, I don't think we realize how much he brings to this team, and I thought just the multiple dimensions that he put out there tonight, and particularly the numbers, uh, were outstanding. Uh, while an MVP candidate caliber player still had a really big night, you kept them at 103 when they're averaging 115. So do you feel like you guys hit job one right on the 10? Yeah, uh, we executed our defense well. Um, you know, they still shot a lot of threes, but as long as they're contested threes, uh, we're going to live with those. And, uh, um, you know, we need to show that every night. And, um, you know, tonight we did that, and hopefully we're going to continue like that. So often when you guys are struggling and find yourself on the wrong side of the ledger, there's always that one period in the game where things don't go well. You guys really didn't have one that was an elongated period. What was critical to having a collective sound, consistent effort tonight? Yeah, I agree. Um, you know, the game is long, so the other team, they're going to make runs. We just need to be calm, solid, and, you know, uh, try to execute our plays in defense and in offense. And uh, if you do that, you know, the, the game gonna the game going to be close. And, uh, you know, tonight we did an amazing job. Tough to rank wins, but you have 12 on the year. This has got to be one of the top ones with the caliber of team that you beat and also starting this homestand the way you want to. Yes, they are. Uh, they're one of the top teams in NBA. They play uh, really well. And, um, you know, I'm glad uh, that we won this game. But, um, you know, we still need to get better, continue to work, and hopefully have uh, more of these kind of games this season. Congratulations on the win. Thanks for the time, Dragon. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, Jack. Goran Dragic leaving the building. Solid night for the tip of the spear. As he finishes the contest, Dragon style. 21 points, 8 rebounds, 8 assists, and with victory. 109, 103 the final. The Heat win right here on Biscayne Boulevard. Hear the joy. We're coming right back. <laughs> if you'd like to catch uh, tonight's game again, tune in tonight at midnight or tomorrow at noon as we replay all tonight's action presented by your South Florida Honda dealers. This has been a presentation of Fox Sports Sun, your exclusive home for Miami Heat basketball for Eric Reed and the coach Tony Fiorentino, as well as Christian Hewitt, Ron Rothstein, and John Crowder. I'm merely Jason Jackson. Thank you so much for watching. Coming up next, the debut of Inside the Heat, Shaq Natty. But first, the final take. Guard is my position. I'm like a coach on the floor, so you know I make good decisions. Peripheral vision, deceptive to most. Penetrate, kick it to the wing while staring at the post. Coast to coast, I can take it, cause I'm smarter. Hell of the rock like N1, I shine harder. Make it work harder.
because of my skill. Did him enough to assist, so my team gets a little thrill. I can feel the fact that I got D. Anticipate your mental and rip you like it planned to be. I go behind my back between my legs, crossing free. But don't sag off too much, cause I can hit the three. As you can see, I control the court. General of the court, holding down the whole sport. For short, you can say that I go hard. Three ball on hard wood, smell the essence of a boy. Can we do it for the love? We do it in the streets and we do it on the court. L.A. Vanity's keys on a rock and New York.